Yeah. <laughs> We're looking at a Christmas tree with beautiful sunny skies. It is in the 40s in some spots right now, even 30s if you're in Lakeside. Uh, but we are certainly going to warm up and we uh, feel lucky for that, I'm sure. All right, let's take a look at those current temperatures around the county. Mostly lower 50s if you're living along the coastline into the inland valley areas along the 15 quarter 50s as well. Unless you're in spots like Escondido at 48, Rancho Bernardo as well in the 40s and 45 for you in Poway. Out to Ramona, 42 degrees drop into the 30s last night, now in the 40s. So you can see we're starting to warm up. We still have this low pressure trough that's digging down though along the California coastline that's bringing us cooler temperatures more so starting tomorrow. This trough is going to deepen and it's going to drop our temperatures tomorrow about another five degrees. So right now we're still right around the seasonal average or believe it or not, just slightly above it, but things will change. We're going to see most of the moisture remain to the north of us in the Pacific Northwest, also in Northern California and moving into Central California. However, as you take a look at the timestamp here, on Monday morning, we are going to start to see some clouds pushing into our area. That is because, as I just said, that trough is going to deepen. So as that deepens, it's going to bring us more of that onshore flow. We're going to get a cloudy start to the morning on Monday, also on Tuesday, but it will clear to mostly sunny skies. So a little bit of a mix of sun and clouds on Monday and Tuesday. But as you saw for today, we're looking at absolutely stunning, beautiful blue skies. Pretty much a repeat of what we had yesterday. It'll feel quite similar. However, we won't have the gusty winds. We're looking Looking at calmer conditions, especially in the inland valley areas where we had a wind advisory in effect yesterday. Uh, mountains and deserts as well, that wind advisory has expired. We'll see those winds kicking up just a little bit as we get into uh, tomorrow morning. 22 mile an hour wind gusts for Mount Laguna. And at times we'll see that reach up into uh, the 30s uh, by 8 o'clock in the morning. 30 mile an hour wind gusts for Mount Laguna and 20s in uh, areas like Julian. So we'll continue to see those winds blowing at times in the mountains and deserts, but much calmer along the coast and into the inland valley areas. For today, temperatures about a degree, one to two degrees warmer than they were yesterday. So 68 degrees for us at the coast, plenty of sunshine, 72 in the inland valley areas, which by the way is a couple of degrees above the seasonal average, even though it feels chilly this morning. 64 our mountains and in our desert, 73 degrees. Coming up next, we'll take a look at the seven day extended forecast. We do have a cold. We will take it. We've got temperatures that are on the rise as well to match those beautiful conditions outside. Now getting up into the upper 50s and 60s in many parts of the county, and we will top out today slightly above the seasonal average before temperatures drop tomorrow and Tuesday. With that on tomorrow, with that tomorrow and Tuesday, we're going to see some increased cloud cover, especially in those morning hours though. We're going to see an onshore flow, a deepening of a low pressure trough, and that's going to bring us cooler conditions and a little bit of that cloud cover throughout the area, extending all the way from the coast into our inland valley areas in the mornings before clearing to mostly sunny skies. So we'll still get plenty of that sunshine in the afternoon afternoon hours. And here's how it looks slightly warmer today just by a degree or two five or so degrees cooler by tomorrow increased cloudiness in the morning hours clearing to mostly sunny skies coast and inland valley areas then Wednesday that trough weakens we see more sunshine temperatures on the rise so slightly warmer on Wednesday more so into Thursday where temperatures peak 69 at the coast 70 in our inland valley areas and that will continue into Friday calmer winds for our mountains and deserts, although we could see gusts between 20 and 30 miles per hour in areas like Mount Laguna at higher elevations today. In our deserts, maybe a little bit of blowing dust and sand, but uh, nothing like what we were seeing in the last 24 hours or so with that wind advisory in effect. Temperatures dip down in the mountains to 46 degrees on Wednesday before climbing back up into the 50s and beautiful conditions, 70s over the next uh, day or so in our local desert areas. Then down into the 60s for us for just a few days before that low pressure trough weakens, as I was saying, and temperatures come up a little bit. We will reach back to 70 on Friday and 71 for Saturday. That's a look at your extended forecast, guys.